Assalamu alaikum and Eid Mubarak to everyone. I hope you have been having an amazing Eid. For those of you that don't know, Eid is a religious festival for Muslims. Um, we have two Eids a year, but we just had Eid al Adha, where those that are eligible to and can afford to will sacrifice an animal and give that meat to their friends, family, and especially poor people. Um, so it's all about giving to those less fortunate. As well as that, just like any other festival, it's a time for family and friends to get together and just enjoy each other's company. So my parents booked a cottage up in Strunra for me and my family. So my brother's family came from Leicester and me and Hussein came and my nephews were there and my brother, my younger brother was there too. And we spent three nights there. It was a beautiful place. It was near the beach. So we got to walk down to the, the sea um, and there was a small town as well where we got to go to things like see the castle and the museum. Um, but what we decided to do for a laugh was, instead of just expecting my mum to do all the cooking, we decided to do a couples come dine with me. So it was me and Hussein versus my elder brother and his wife, Safraz and Khadija. Um, and we chose time slots and cooked a meal for that. It was meant to be a laugh, but we decided to go all out and do it as authentically as we could. And yeah, we recorded the whole thing, so I hope you enjoy watching our Come Eat With Me, Come Down With Me special. Um, and yeah, tell me if you think the right people won. Don't forget to watch my other videos. So there's one of Hussein doing my makeup and one about falling in love with a sick person. So yeah, enjoy! So today on Come Eat With Me, we have newlyweds Hussein and Sana. And parents of two, Safraz and Khadija, aka Bajan and Babi. Hussein and Sanaa are stepping up to the hot plate first, so let's check out their menu. For stars, champion's fish cake with homemade tartar sauce. Dad's not here, ah, right. he's falling asleep as usual. No problem. Starter. Champion fish cake with homemade tartar sauce. That sounds good. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds good, okay? Right. Hmm. Champion's fish cake with a homemade tartar sauce. Mm. Champions fish cake. I hope it's fresh and not frozen fish. I can't eat frozen fish. <laughs> the fish cake sounds nice, but the mm, tartar sauce I'm not sure about. Champion fish cake with a hum, hum, homemade starter sauce. Do you like fish cake? Do you not like fish cake? Well, that's a good start. Oh, are you not looking forward to the star then? Actually, actually I'm not sure because I've never had fish cake You've never had fish cake before? What about tartar sauce? Uh, tartar sauce. Do you know what tartar sauce is? No. No? Oh, that's going to be a first for you then. Champions fish cake with a homemade tartar sauce. Champions fish cake drill. Since it's saying champions, it has to be good, man. But fish cake I'm not really too keen on. I like tartar sauce, but tartar sauce is always nice. And for the main all round winner chicken roux lads served with pom puree and jus. Our mains all round winner chicken roulade served with steamed vegetables. Pom puree, pom pee, pom pee, pom pee. Thickest bridge. Ah, pom potato. Why just try potato? <laughs> potato puree with jus. It's jus. So chicken's gonna be like. Roulade means it's been rolled. Okay. And it's probably got some kind of stuffing. Right. Okay. I hope it's not cheese. Okay. Look, I don't do cheese well. So you're looking forward to that then? I am looking forward to that. Yeah. All round. Oh, I'm chicken with that. Can't go for it, are vegetables. Mm. Steam vegetables. <laughs> Sounds very interesting, doesn't it? <laughs> with a pom puree. What's that? Chips mashed and up. Just, <laughs> and just. And oh. juice. Oh, that's the sauce. Oh. I think it's fried, maybe. Uh, it's a sauce. Uh, what are the mains? The mains? It doesn't, I don't know what, is it roast chicken? Is it, okay. is it, is it yeah. fried chicken? What is it? I don't know. I've just is, it, is, it, is it mainland chicken? Sounds nice. You know? I don't know. Right, I'm looking forward to it. The mains are all, all round winner chicken laid served with steamed vegetables, cucumber, and just. It's called. Je. Looking forward to the main then? Uh, probably. Yeah. Yeah? Why? But I'm not sure about the last part. What's the last part? What's the last part? The just? Yeah, no. 
Oh, yeah, right. I never you never heard of that? Like oh, okay. But you're gonna look forward to the chicken, innit? Yeah. 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 <laughs> All round winner chicken, roulade, roulade served with steamed vegetables and a plum puree. Just. Oh, just call it wherever you want. I give up. Yeah, I'm not too sure what the plum puree just is, but again, it'll be a good surprise, hopefully. The winner chicken roulade, I'll. Oh, Seen that, so it has to be good, man. And to round it off, Ui Gui Mint Conqueror Brownie with double cream and aero shavings. Ui Gui Mint Conqu Conqueror, oh, Conqueror with Brownie mind. with double cream and Oreo shavings. Mm, that, that sounds yummy, yeah. but I'm not a dessert person. It mm. always sounds yummy, okay. but we'll see. Ui Gui Mint. Conqueror brownie. brownie with double cream and Oreo shavings. That sounds nice. Yeah. I'm looking forward to that. Two confident uh, champions, fish all and, and all round winner. So it has to be a yeah. 10 out of 10, isn't it? It has to be 10 out of 10. It has to. If it's not a 10 out of 10, it's going to be a 1 out of 10 yeah. straight up. You know what I mean? There's no in between. Looking <laughs> <laughs> yeah. forward to it. Gooey gooey mint conqueror brownie with double cream. And all your shaving. How does that sound? It's I like delicious. It. Delicious. The last yeah, one sounds delicious, but the yeah, I like the whole I thing except sure. for the for the cream. Oh. Oogie, ooey, gooey. I'm not. I'm not looking forward to, <laughs> to that. We <laughs> mint con conqueror brownie with a double cream and aero shavings. Oh yeah, aero. See dessert. I'm not too keen on dessert. I'm not a really sweet person. I think I'm, I'm sweet enough. Isn't it? I agree, young man. What's going on here? Just getting ready to make that tartar sauce, you know, the homemade oh. edition. Oh, there you go. For the fish cakes and that, yeah. For the fish cakes, that's it. And what, you doing nothing, as usual? Um, I'm going to start making the mashed potato for the Pom mains. puree, call the, the right thing. The pom puree for the, the mains. So I need to just oh, peel these, wash them in there. Don't want dirty pom puree. Not bad, not bad. So now I am grating the arrow to go into the double cream because this is what's going to go on top of the brownie. Um, I didn't just want to do boring cream, I thought because we're doing like a mint dessert, it would be nice if we get the mint taste in it. Um, and yeah, who doesn't like chocolate and cream together? So yeah. It's going to be well ready for the fish cakes and then I'm going to sear off the chickens, the chicken roulade, which I've prepared already. The juice go in as well. Um, so yeah, everything is about to kick off, I think. <laughs> See what happens. The scene starts putting the fish cakes in the fire as it's almost time to serve the starter. He then preps the main to cook while everyone eats. Now it's really time to kick off. Champions fish cake with homemade tartar sauce. What was it? Yeah. yeah. We have our champions uh, fish cake with homemade tartar sauce. They've okay, added the oh word champions on it. Champions. Yeah. 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 I didn't read um, there's, yes. there's some extra tartar sauce um, and there's also ketchup and chili sauce for anybody that wants to mix it up as well. The fish is haddock and it's, um, the breadcrumbs are homemade as well. Oh! Wait, fish, don't let them ask us. Let them ask us. Yeah. Yeah. Interrogation time. Everybody ready for next? Yeah. 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 
all round when a chicken roulade served with all the trimmings and jus. Very nice. Looks delicious. Rolled in, it's wrapped with turkey bacon, turkey bashes, and we've got mozzarella, pesto, and then it's just a few little surprises in there for you as well. And then we've got the jus, pom puree, and steamed veg. Hope you like it. So, what was your inspiration for this uh, dish? Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, I feel like chicken's always a winner, and then just to add a few more different kicks to it, we thought. We've had a few other dishes, other spices and elements within it. Mm -hmm. And then the jus is just to bring it all together because it's um, chicken breast, which is always quite dry. So the jus will just help moisten that up a bit. Moving on to dessert, the ooey gooey mint conqueror brownie. But wait, where's the double cream? Looks like someone is still playing charades. Everyone's done. Yay. 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 Yeah, so you've read all your names. Now we're playing the game called Who's Most Likely To? So you're holding your pairs and the last question, the first person to get a full slice of pizza, give out cards each, is the winner. Okay? okay. So, first okay. question Who's most likely to cause an argument? Oh. Go on. You can't see. You said Granny, oh, Safraz, but <laughs> yeah, 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 Sana, Sana. Oh, I said, agree with me. Yes. Or I just caused the argument. There you go. I'm Sam. How's your mood? Honesty is the best. Honesty is the best thing. What are you most likely to find in front of the TV first thing in the morning? Disagreed again. I can't remember all of these. Granny, Granny, cut, Safaraz. Umharu, Umharu. Sana, Sana. Do you never wake in the morning? Yeah. 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 That's why I said Sana, because Shabazz never yeah, yeah. 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 Who's most likely to always be a busybody, yeah. always having to move around, do something? Me, you. Me, you. Granny, Granny, Actually, cuts, wait. cuts. No, Goo -goo. I see, I was up busy myself first. Um, Umu Faruk, Umu Faruk. Does everyone yeah. agree apart from you two? <laughs> yeah, yeah, we get a slap. Okay, close though, we've got two people who have nearly finished the game. What? Yeah, because yeah, they've been getting it right. Oh. Who's most likely to <laughs> never admit they're wrong? Oh. oh. No! <laughs> no. Granny, Granny, so for us, cut. No, yeah, 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 yeah. guys. Sana, you you I'm half and half. Like Listen, we... I'm not wrong, you're right. right. <laughs> Tonight, the way it goes there. Nah, who's, not, who's, not not, who's not admitting they're wrong right now? I, I'm, <laughs> not, <laughs> I'm, not, <laughs> I, I'm a thing when we both admit when we're wrong, and he's like, no, he doesn't. Well, we've got a joint winner then. Yeah. So. yeah. <laughs> this is the end of our Come Down With Me night. Um, hope you had a good time. Oh. Now you just have to go away and
score us. Yeah, yeah. 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 Where's the number one card? <laughs> <laughs> Taxis! Hey, that's my line. Anyway, let's see what everyone thought about the meal. I think it was good. Um, everybody ate everything, and if they didn't eat anything, they said because it was like too much of it. Yeah. So I think it was Apart from the one. turkey rashers, but I think... It was just choice though, isn't it? Some people like it, some yeah. people don't. But overall, they still enjoyed the meal. Right yeah. yeah. And everybody enjoyed like the, the presentation of everything, and they enjoyed mm. the entertainment. And they didn't notice that the double cream wasn't... On the, on the dessert, so... No one notices that, so you kind of got away with that one. Yeah. Would you have changed anything about tonight? Change anything on the menu? Or the um, entertainment? I don't think I would have changed anything. I think the starter, I think we would have given them less. Yeah, we would have given them one fish cake yeah. instead of two. Because we didn't want them to say we didn't give them enough and we ended up giving them too much. I think that could, 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 can spoil it. I think I would have also put less turkey rashers on because I wrapped it up completely. So we would just put like one little slice on yeah. it because... Obviously, we like it, so we put a lot, yeah. but people mm. obviously didn't. So, what would you score yourself out of 10 tonight if you just were born? Obviously, oh, you said 10! <laughs> <laughs> Come on! Smashed it! <laughs> Saman Hussein's a starter champion um, fish cakes with the homemade tartar sauce were lovely. With the wedge of lemon was quite nice. I did feel the portions were quite big, and uh, to be honest, I. I I was worried if I'd be able to eat the main. However, I finished the starter and I was able to have the main. Jan's back now. He's mm -hmm. had some of the food. What about the main? My main was okay. Mm. Main was nice, spicy, and uh, you can taste uh, uh, chicken and supper and everything meat with, and uh, all meat. the fruit elements. Oh, all the spices, you can taste the spices, mm. the spices they put in. It's mm. good effort. Mm. It's mm. very good effort. What about the dessert? Dessert, um, I am a chocolate man. I mean, I like chocolate, but it's not, it's too much chocolatey. Mm. Mm. I'm not a dessert or chocolate person, but uh, it looked the yeah, the presentation was, was the presentation was good. And uh, the few spoons I did eat was very nice. The, the uh, presentation was good. Car. It was very nice. No, it was very nice, but I'm not a chocolate person. It was very nice. Overall, life was brilliant. Was very good the nice. entertainment was very funny. It was mm -hmm. good. It was yeah. good. So, yes. Yeah, that's okay. That one. That's good. I agree with okay. this Marks out of 10 Please then. Four, seven. Seven. Overall seven. Is this their room? <laughs> wow. <laughs> what a funny name. Hello, what is your name? <laughs> yeah, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't like cats in the dining room when you're eating, you know. Oh, yeah. but you know she was lovely and they took her yeah. away straight away. So. Now that they have done snooping, that was nice. Lovely. It was lovely. Do you know when we walked mm. in, the food was already out and yeah. all that. It was really nice. It was um, nice. I like the way how the entertainment was when we walked in. I was impressed with the tartar lovely. sauce, the, the homemade tartar sauce. Yeah. One of? criticism of the fish cake, alright, and I'm going to be picky on that, but mine was ever so slightly burnt. Yeah. Alright, so I don't I don't want to be like... It was nice. It was I nice. liked it. I don't yeah. like tart sauce, like I yeah. did say before, but I did like the fish cake. Yeah. But I couldn't eat two though. Oh, that's too heavy for starter. Yeah, it was quite heavy. I was quite... I wouldn't say I was full, but I was like quite satisfied. Yeah. Yeah. I <laughs> saved myself for the mains. Yeah. But the mains, the mains was, it was nice, but it was like... They came and put the plates out and they took the plates away and I was like, what's going on? Are we going to get fed or not? But <laughs> and then we had to wait. <laughs> but they, they, no, bless them, they tried, they were trying, they were, they were like under I think there was that. a lot of people. Yeah. It's, it, yeah. And I'm sure with us there, it's yeah. not that easy. No. We would be like, yeah. I'm sure the food was lovely. Uh, the company, company was, was good. really good. Yeah, it's good luck. And uh, do you know what? All the, all the food was really good. Yeah. Apart from what I said earlier on, the fish cake was slightly overcooked. Nice. The dessert was amazing. Yeah, that was lovely. The boy eating is a bit too rich. It was a bit rich. The portion was slightly it? on the heavier side. You didn't finish it? Did I you? didn't finish it, but it was still lovely and tasty. Got to rate them for that. Uh, the mains? The mains, yeah. The mains were lovely. Yeah. You finished all your mains? I, I cleaned the plate. I, I myself thought it was lovely. Man. I didn't. I didn't like the turkey rasher, so I had to kind of like make a mess and <laughs> dig through a bit. Okay, but it tasted lovely. It was. And you know, I have to take points off you for the fact that you took the put the plates on the table, and I got all excited, and then you took the plates away again. So that was a bit of a. What, what you say? It was a bit of a naughty move. 
If that didn't happen, I would have given you more points. Okay, so what points are we giving you? So, we're giving you uh, no, seven. seven. Yeah. <laughs> well done, guys. Well done. The stars. I did like the stars, but then they gave me something else from the recipe, which I did like, and mm. it was chicken nuggets. What about you, Mofarik? Mm. I I like the marsh, but not the fish. Not the fish. I don't really like the fish curry. But did they give you something else instead? Uh, no, they didn't. Yeah, they did give me a, a few chicken nuggets. My favorite part was the, of the meal was the... The vegetables? Yeah, the vegetables. The vegetables, yeah. The vegetables, just the vegetables. Just the vegetables. And that sauce at the bottom. The sauce, yeah, the juice. My favorite part... I, I like the chicken a bit, but the favorite part was the wash. The mash. I don't really like veggies of the carrots. Mm. I, I like it when it's fully, when it's a full color, but I don't like it when it's cut, mm, cut in any shape. Yeah, and boiled. Mm. The legs, but it was quite good. Yeah, the, yeah, yeah. the dessert was very nice. At yeah. first when I read the menu, and I read like, you do eat, I thought it was like slime. Yeah, I didn't think it was going to be quite good. But um, when I tried it, it was just green yeah. cream. That was yeah. mint cream. Yeah. So you liked it? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Except for the first part. Yeah. Yeah, I did like that. That one. Yeah, that was yeah. But you can still give it a 10. 10 out of 10. That's generous. Right, went pretty well. Um, enjoyed the food. The stars, fish cake, um, it was quite cold, uh, and it was a big portion as well, but I still enjoyed the one fish cake that I had, I had to leave one because I wanted to keep space for the mains, but yeah, the stars were good, the mains, mains were alright as well, um, I didn't like the turkey rashers and the salami inside, it's a bit too smoky, not my thing, but um, the chicken itself and the, the jus, um, juice was really nice as well, I had a lot of flavour in that, um, the dessert, Oh, mashed potato, the mashed potato was, was on point. Uh, that was probably the best thing of tonight, the mashed potato. Um, had a lot of flavour in that as well. Dessert, I'm not a dessert person, so um, I'm just, I'm a picky person in general. Uh, but I was still, presentation was amazing, and there was a lot of effort gone into that, I could tell. So, because of that, I'm going to be given a seven. So Hussein and Sana's all-star menu sets the bar with a strong 24 out of 40. Now on to the next couple's menu. For the main they are making Hawaiian luau chicken served with a sensational homemade pineapple pina colada. Well second day of come dine with me and this is Safra's and Khatija's menu. Tell you what you should have got menu. Mm. Hawaiian luau. Lua. Lu Lu chicken oh. served with sensational meat pineapple homemade yeah homemade pineapple pina colada mm. oh what's dessert. a pina colada oh. it's a pineapple drink all right no pina colada but I hope they have not put the Hola, rum Hola. in it ha <laughs> 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 what I can so even rum <laughs> uh, what do you uh, think of the Hawaiian chicken uh, chicken okay, but I'm not very keen on pineapple in, mixed with chicken. No, it doesn't say it's mixed with chicken. The pineapple is that's the pina colada drink. Pina colada, all right, yes. right, 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 okay. All right, you will see. For the means we have Hawaiian lua chicken served with, with a sensational homemade pineapple pina colada. So the main. You don't have a starter. You don't have a starter. That's already like minus. Minus a couple two of points. points. The mm. main Hawaiian. Louis, Louis chicken. Louis Louis chicken. Served with a sensational homemade pineapple pina colada. Oh. I don't like pineapples. I don't like <laughs> <laughs> well, that's not good. Uh, I don't like pineapples either. Um. But you can't go wrong with chicken. Hawaiian. Could have made your bed, mate. Served with a sensational homemade pineapple pina colada. Oh. 
Maybe the Alphonse one. We've got another comedian. Try the Lalo chicken. Sounds nice. Hawaiian. I don't really know what to expect. Like, what's it going to be? Is it going to be something stuffed inside the chicken? Or is it going to be Hawaiian? Um, I'm looking forward to it. And for dessert, hula hula chocolate surprise. Dessert is hula hula chocolate surprise. Well, chocolate again, huh? So I'll give it a try. Yeah, we're gonna try and see in the table was. There is no starter. No, just the main and the dessert. Well, it must be good. For them not giving us a starter, it must be. That means the main must be a big one, a big portion. Big portions of main. Mm, I do not want to go home hungry. We'll see. We'll see. Okay. Dessert we have for. For today we have dessert. It's a hula hula chocolate surprise. Hula hula chocolate. Hula hula chocolate surprise. Hula hula. Okay. Dessert is hula hula, 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 hula chocolate surprise. <laughs> It doesn't tell me anything. No, but I think that's the hula, point. Hula. I'm trying to think, but what, what, what? Hula. It's a Hawaiian thing. Oh, yeah, it's all Hawaiian so thing. See, they're it's... not wearing like flowery Hawaiian shirts. And if I don't get like um, a flower, like garland, garland thing. thing, then I'm going to be really disappointed. Um, I don't like pineapple, but maybe it tastes good. I'll have to wait and see. We shall see. We Hula hula chocolate surprise. Um, that sounds good. Um, again, what's going to make it um, hula hula and what's the surprise? So, looking forward to that as well. But um, I don't know where the, the starters go. But, oh well. Still looking forward to it. But. Let's see how the couple are getting on in the kitchen. So, yeah, we're firing all cylinders. Hmm? How's it going? We're halfway through with doing the mains. We're just going to yeah, pan fry and then up. That's us making the mousse for the dessert. And then we'll have to turn the fridge to set. Do you think we can beat them? Yeah, we can. <laughs> Do you think we can beat them? Too late. There you go then. <laughs> So what are you doing over here then? So we're just garnishing the chicken to go into the oven. It's been pan fried, skewered, smashed. So what are you putting on top there right now? There's mozzarella cheese. There. Mozzarella cheese, mmm. I like mozzarella cheese. That's ready to go into the oven. I'll see you in a bit, mate. Brilliant. Since we're at the beach, we thought we'd do a luau. So yeah, come on in and I kick 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 to you. Hawaiian luau chicken served with a sensational homemade pineapple pina colada. It's be romantic, I kick 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 kick. It's the color of pineapple each. Time to try the pina colada. This is a pina colada. Yeah, but put it back on now, we should get snapped. And uh, for your mains, you have a uh, luau chicken uh, with uh, homemade veggies. That's it, yeah. <laughs> Time for the first couple to ask their questions. What is it, chicken? Is that pineapple? Uh, it's made with, what it's makes made it with chicken. Hawaiian? Is that pineapple? What makes it Hawaiian? It goes complements the uh, peanut butter. It's got a bit of everything. And it's got the tomato and try it, try it, try it, try it. Uh, wine and cheese pasta. Did, did you give your tea for me? Chicken, it tastes really nice. Um, I like there's a lot of pesto in it. I like pesto. Veg, veggies, <laughs> it's good. 
I'm not gonna lie, like I don't really like pineapple. Mm. No, I was dreading when I read Hawaii and mm. they, they do put chicken. Uh, oh my god, uh, they're, they're going to be disappointed when I say I'm not eating this and I'm not eating it. It's really the, the Hawaiian thing came no, from the pineapples. Um, the inspiration was the like, like, as I drink, like, saw that, it was amazing. Like, yeah, it does. That was really good. He'd be wearing like flowery shorts and have like flower <laughs> garlands and no, stuff. No, I'm not going to be wearing the glasses. <laughs> We, 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 did, we did have it ready, but we couldn't do the dance, so we left it. Aww. But they're not going to take the dance. I'm enjoying the chicken oh, once right. I remove it. Okay. <laughs> you see, Chad finished. She was very good to eat. It was nice, that's right. Right. Everybody ready for desserts? Yeah. 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 And now time for the hula hula chocolate surprise that has it had everyone wondering what it is. Chocolate surprise. Hula, 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 chocolate surprise. What's the surprise? Well, your surprise is going to be over there. Oh, that's I don't know what the surprise is. <laughs> What's the surprise? Angel Delight. No. Mm. Strawberries. Well, that leads me to my first question. Did you make the mousse yourself? Yeah, yeah, of course we did. How did you oh. make it? Open the bucket. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> With desserts done, it's now on to the entertainment. With locked round just a stone throw away from the dinner table, the couple treated everyone to a guided walk down to the water. The weather was perfect for shell collecting. After finding a live jellyfish, it was time to head back and score Bison and Barbie on the mule. What did you think was delicious? I thought, I thought the chicken burger was the best, but I love the, the dessert, the, the, the chocolate surprise, because I like it, but I like it a bit better <coughs> with a bit less mousse. With a bit less mousse? No. no. With a bit less chocolate brownie and it wasn't that much to fill your stomach up mm. when you're nearly halfway through in I a small cup. I thought the burger was quite nice it's, and the dessert it may have looked small but it was quite filling. So did you enjoy it? Because it, it had some chocolate cream that was really nice and, uh, and um, the mousse was quite nice you see, that's the part that I was feeling, and the brownie was delicious. That was at the part, so that made a very good mixture. We thought we would give it a 10. Today now with Bajan Bobby, they cook some amazing food for us. You can tell they put a lot of effort in with the pineapple pina coladas. Um, so food tasted really good, pineapple was really good. We felt like the entertainment lacked a bit because it was just a beachfront. Who saw that we coming? Had, we didn't have any starters, so we felt like we had to knock on points for that. Also, um, the dessert we felt was better cheap because None of it was actually homemade yeah. uh, from scratch. Um, but like I said, we had a really nice night and we enjoyed how everything tasted. So for that reason, we're giving them a seven. seven. Well, tonight's night with uh, my Bajan and Babi's menu, um, I was a bit disappointed to have a starter. The mains were good. Dessert, I'm not a sweet person. I'm, I'm sweet enough, like I've said before in it. So um, yeah, it was, it was all right. Could have been better. The chicken was a bit dry. I think if they had something like some sauce with it, it would have been a bit better. And the entertainment as well. Entertainment could have been better. Better as well, even though it's just a walk. But for that reason, I'm going to give a uh, seven. Scoring so for Safraz and Katija's menu. Yeah. Uh, the chicken Hawaiian. It was good, but I, I don't know why it didn't serve a, a, a starter. We just skinned the main meal. 
but, but however, the main meal. The presentation was, was good. Beautiful. Yeah, the it was lovely. Presentation it was a wow. Was beautiful. Wow. Can you bring my pickle out? I don't like. No. Then like the. Uh, I'm not a person for a pina colada thing. But the presentation was good. I mm. give him for that. Yeah, good for yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, and the pina colada. Oh, shame we're not scoring on the drink because if we, had, we were scoring on the drinks, it would be ten out of ten because the other team did. Oh, they did have. Oh, they had pink, uh, chilo, bubbly. pink bubbly. But this was beautiful. However, yeah. however, the dessert. No, uh, no. I I enjoyed I enjoyed the. Hawaiian do a chicken. I did not like the pesto, but it was nice. The veggies were lovely. The vegetables were lovely. Dessert. You you say something about the dessert because I'm not yeah, a dessert, dessert person. Dessert. I'm, I'm I'm a dessert person, but I didn't like it's uh, the, the 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 chocolate surprise they said, but it's, it was a uh, reconstructed. Fire. Everything was bold. It was it was reconstructed. Surprise was, surprise was they the did reason. not they make didn't. it at home. Oh. Yeah, they didn't so, they didn't prepare themselves. But it was a, uh, what's this, uh, well, angel it's dessert, oh. angel delight, yeah. angel delight okay. and some stuff. So stacking. we'll score them. I'm going to give uh, some fries. We've had good two days of nice, amazing food. <laughs> um, it was tight, very tight. One team had 23 points and one team had 24 points. Oh! Hang on, we need to find out together who wins. So I was, yep, it was only one point away. Oh! oh. But there has to be one winner. <laughs> Suspense. Hi, <laughs> Gabby, drum roll, please. Yeah. Yeah. Winners are yeah. Sana and Lucia. Yeah. 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 <laughs> So with mum and dad scoring Bison and Bobby a 7, that gave them a total of 23, which put Hussein and Sana at the top spot. Don't go spend that imaginary money all at once. But the real winners are all the people that got away with not cooking and ate such great food. Eid Mubarak everyone, thanks for watching. Ha <laughs> ha